folks my name's Ian I'm the worship leader at the dwelling gonna go live again this morning uh, I'm bringing you day 20 of the Bible reading plan light in the darkness that should be week 4 day 2 uh, we're gonna be reading from 2nd Chronicles 930 uh, to 1017 and if you want to go ahead and join up on this Bible reading plan or want to find it real quick it, it is should be in the description um, morning Scott how's it going um, so anyway my overwhelming thought for this particular reading was the fact that it's a lot easier for me to seek help or seek advice from people I want to hear from uh, it's not always as easy to listen to people that are telling you something opposite of what you believe or want to hear and then another thought <clears throat> is that this is just a good reminder of uh, God saying to the people of Israel at the beginning you don't want a human king you don't want a human king and uh, <clears throat> I think this this week we're gonna see a lot of examples of why God is our good king so <clears throat> with that is I'm going to reflect on a song called Broken Vessels. All these pieces broken and scattered in mercy gathered mended and Empty-handed, but not forsaken. I've been set free. I've been set free. Amazing grace, how sweet the sound that saved a wretch like me. Oh, I once was lost, but now I'm found. take our weakness you set our treasure in jars of clay so take this heart Lord I'll be your vessel the world to see your life in me amazing grace how sweet the sound the same wretch like me oh I once was lost but now I'm found was blind but now I see oh I can see you now I can see the love in your eyes laying yourself down
folks, I hope you have a good morning. Uh, and I hope that what sticks with you is the fact that God is above everything and we can trust him and he is a good God. Y'all have a good day. Well, I'll figure out how to finish this. <laughs> All right, bye-bye.